This season, we're shining the spotlight on some of the leading women working in motorsport who are inspiring the next generation of female drivers, mechanics, and engineers. Sophie Edelfang is a powertrain specialist with Porsche Penske Motorsport, traveling to races like the 12 Hours of Sebring to help keep their 963s on the track. In general speaking, we are responsible for uh, making the powertrain work, uh, making it function. So we do in preparation everything to ensure this, which includes checking the data, check that every sensor is working, every backup sensor is working, and also have a look on the data, how it's performed during FP1, FP2, FP3. Since it's not a road car, you need to treat the car a bit differently, you need to get it up on temperature, you have the HV system, you also have the engine which needs to be preheated. So this is the first thing we do in the morning to ensure the car is warm and ready. If something is happening during the free practice, you need to react on your side and you're kind of the first lane of defense if something is happening. In between the sessions, the goal is scanning the data, see if something comes around we need to do, and also re-preparing the car for the next session. If you're lucky, get some food in between. You have mainly on qualifying day a bit more time to see which settings you need to adjust to get the most out of it, but also checking the spares, ensure everything is fine. This time on the sixth car and the sister car we had a crash, so therefore we need to deep dive and investigate what needs to be changed to ensure we are good for tomorrow. During the race we have a couple of options. We have information due to the telemetry and also we can make changes to improve, we have backup strategies, we have backup sensors. So those are cases where you can react immediately while driving. And then of course, I'm sitting on the pit stand. If the car goes to the garage, it's quite a time for me to go from A to B. So everybody needs to work together, clear calls, what needs to be checked. Then we also need the answer. So you already do the analysis while you're on the way from A to B. For me, is to have a good understanding about your system, what you are responsible for. I am responsible here for the powertrain, so we have the engine, we have the gearbox, we have also the HV system, it's a hybrid car, so it's quite a complex situation. You can imagine if there's a problem, you have the driver complaining, you have the data showing you hopefully what's the problem, you have information from the crew members, you also have your race engineer, your strategist, so it's like a lot of going on. You need to focus, good in freestyling and draw conclusions out of the situation as quick as possible. That's the goal. It's an endurance race, so being a good engineer is, is key on this one. You can still win the race even if you have problems, if you're smart.